Hey guys, how you doing? Thanks for tuning in and watching. If you guys can all do me a big ass solid and subscribe to my fitness channel. Uh, I've been at this for quite some time now. I plan on uploading more videos for you guys to watch. Hopefully I can help a few individuals reach their fitness goals. And here goes nothing. So today was back day. Um, I picked up some tips from one of the best natural bodybuilders in the world, Kaiushi Moody. He seems to do a lot of drop sets. And as you can see here, I'm starting out with the lat pull down. And I usually typically start out at a heavier weight, try to get, you know, eight to 10 reps, drop it, try to get 10 to 12, drop it again, tr try to get 12 to 15, and then drop it if I'm feeling good one more time and try to really burn it out and get. 20 reps um i think i ended this with 100 pounds at 20 reps and i think i started with 175 i'll tell you what guys like i remember just back in the day working out chasing the pump with my friends and not so much worrying about strength this feels so much better to me i mean we are bodybuilders at the end of the day not not saying that a powerlifting split wouldn't work and it does I just feel like I can't do it anymore. Like I'll have like six good weeks of a powerlifting split and then I'll like I'll get hurt and then I'll be out of the gym for maybe like I don't know, two to three weeks. So my main goal is to stay in the gym and activating those muscles. And I think moving forward, I'm I'm gonna not really worry about strength so much. I'm gonna worry about you know feeling just good like i'm hitting 40 in july like it just it just doesn't make any sense for me to like i'm not gonna put on that that much more muscle it's just not gonna happen so why not just just go after a good pump stay relatively in good shape and then if i ever want to do another bodybuilding show it won't take me that long to get in shape uh the second exercise i did was seated row um I forgot what I started with. I think I started I started with like 190, then dropped it to like 160, and then ended with maybe like the 130s. Um, yeah, it just felt really good. Um, it's a cardio session, like, and I might not always do drop sets. I might like do like you know pyramid schemes, but I I I honestly feel like the one to three rep days are, are done for me <laughs> I, I just can't uh, you know I was out of the game for a minute with like the whole you know what's been going on in the world for the past two years and I'm finally I'm back in love with the gym and this feels so good going back to my roots how I used to train like instinctively like 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 right now I'm, I'm already thinking about what I'm gonna do tomorrow for or for legs like I have like the leg press machine and I'm gonna keep dropping weight. Hopefully I'll record it for you guys. And if there's anything you guys wanna see or know, just drop a comment down below and I'll, and I'll, I'll help you guys out as much as I can. Or you can reach, um, you can personally reach me at, on Facebook, you know, Joe Rich, or you know, Instagram, All Business Fitness. I'm always around. The third exercise I did was, I think they call these seal rows. Um, I really like these because they just activate the back in a way like no other exercise can. Just felt really good. And as you can see, I have the bench elevated on a step-up platform. And like if you have longer arms, obviously you can... This will work for just about anybody. And I didn't go for um, a lighter weight than this. As you saw on the previous exercises, I think I had at least bare minimum of three different weight weights that I use, but right here I just I stopped with two. Was really feeling it, and then I think I ended with yeah some arms, um, biceps. I don't I never can't say I never, but I don't really just have a complete arm day anymore. I just think for a natural bodybuilder it's it's too much. You know I just watched a video. Sometimes I like go to go back and watch like the old like a. Uh, Olympians like Lee Priest I think he had like 30 sets for like biceps I mean I think that's overkill for a natural the guy was enhanced but 
yeah, so I did three rounds of this for, for um, hammer curls for the biceps. And they were screaming. They were burning. So, and the, and the, 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 to get away with, like, the, the bonus or, like, the plus at the end of this was I, I walked away from the gym without an injury. Like, that is, like, your, your number one goal is to make sure that you're set up for the next workout. Like, I never want to be out of the gym anymore. Like, that's, that's my, that's my, that's my therapy. Like, a lot of people, like, you know, they do certain things to, to get them through the day. And, like, the gym is, like, you know, I love the gym. Like, I love it more than I ever have, I think. It's just, it's a good feeling. Um, and then I, sh I think I have something from um, yesterday. So I, and I'll, I'll, I'll record my chest workout, but I ended with, I always end my chest workout with some push-ups. As you can see where my hands and my elbows are placed. A lot of people will, will place their hands almost parallel with the shoulders. I think that's, you're asking for trouble. Um, there's no arch in my back. Actually, I have my, my ass up. And I'm really just kind of activating that chest, feeling the pump. It felt so good. Yeah, it just felt so good. I was I was completely pumped up. Guys, thanks for watching. What do you want to know? Don't forget, please subscribe to my channel. It would mean the world to me. And hopefully I can upload many more videos like this for you. You guys all have a blessed day.